Hi everyone, today I have another video with this transformer. Uh, you know probably this transformer from my past videos. But today I have something special. I have two of these NVIDIA chips. Uh, they are from old motherboards and I um, disconnected from these boards for I don't use these boards anymore for. Uh, they are broken. Uh, actually, I uh, have these wires. I know they are pretty weak for uh, this transformer for this transformer can go up to something like 260 amps and uh, yeah these cables are very 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 weak um, from what I know this chip here is from a GPU uh, named N4610 something like this you can search by code from it yeah uh, I soldered the wires directly on uh, the actual chip for I want to power it on and this I don't know what it is but it is also a GPU I think um, now I hope I will don't uh, blow anything now for um, here is the actual chip and this uh, oriented in this direction if it will pop to don't pop into my camera or my face and I hope I will don't burn these cables so I will use um, my transformer now I will connect it to the wires and I will plug it in and there is a chance to pop my breaker for I changed the breaker with a smaller one for better protection but it's here a chance to pop it so let me power this on oh my gosh I can see the cables are now hot yeah they are very hot oh actually they melted a little bit and as you can see here how how squishy they are but the actual board don't seems to uh, have any damage or any visible damage hmm. probably this power isn't enough to actually blow this board some bubbles appeared on it hmm. I will try to use this a little longer oh my gosh that's too much I think for these cables and I, I just said I don't want to burn them for now there is a smell in all my room oh my gosh this is bad but yeah um, the actual board from Nvidia doesn't seem to have anything transformer itself is actually a little warm but not hot so, um, yeah, actually I will disconnect it and uh, I will try to disconnect the actual chip from the transformer to see what uh, happened to it and there is uh, a damage to it, but the cables, the cables, no why. Aren't, are not hot uh, now okay and now as you can see here in seconds um, my cables are melted oh this chip is hot and that's probably for uh, I used much power on it but uh, one thing I'm pretty sure about oh my gosh a small bit oh One thing uh, I'm uh, sure about it is um, there is better if I don't do this solder for now uh, the current can flow more easily through this and burn my cables instead of burning the actual chip and here as you can see there is a problem with my cables now um, yeah but as I said they are pretty weak for this shit so 
yeah, I have another one. As I showed to you, I have this chip from here. And I will uh, use the normal transformers. A normal transformer, I have another one with plates and it can go up to 600 amps. So I will use that, that one instead. Okay, here we are with this transformer. You probably know it from my uh, past videos. Uh, it can go to up to 600 amps um, and it can only draw this point uh, just 3 amps from the socket and that's very good for me. But here I don't have much voltage so yeah, the, here is the thing why it uh, draw that uh, less power. And here is the actual uh, NVIDIA chip and I will use these screws with like this. Oh my gosh, I can hear it. Let me check. Okay, it works. Um, probably I need to take this one as well. Oh. That's a little bit dangerous. Or something can pop in, into me or into my face. And I don't like this. Um, I, I don't like that. Oh my gosh, now it's a really fucked smell here. Yeah, probably I need to do this shits outside. Not inside my house. But, yeah. Yeah, I probably just destroyed this one. For normally, these are connected them um, one to each other. Oh, I actually can see here some bubbles inside the board. So yeah, I probably just destroyed that chip. As you can see, the traces are instantly dying. So let's get a look to chip it. Yeah, my English is bad now. Hmm, not a pretty big deal with it. Yeah, this here is hot, but something about it, no. Actually, I, um, I thought it will blow or something like that. Okay, better idea. Um, I ripped the cables where I soldered on this one, and I will try to pop this one one more time, and if you don't pop, I will uh, use this one instead for it can uh, go better, I think. But I'm not sure why this transformer keep buzzing so hard. For I can I can hear the buzzing from this transformer. Oh, that's probably the actual chip. Oh. Now it popped. Oops. I just touched the um, actual screws onto each other. Oh, this one popped hard. Oh, it popped. Oh my gosh, as you can see here, my my uh, screw just became red and super hot. 
yeah, I think it's better to turn off the transformer now for... Mm, actually, the cable is not that hot. It's a little warm. Now, let's look at the chips. This one looks actually good, but it's fucked. Um, but this one, <laughs> let me see how it looks now. It's probably hot, so I don't want to touch it. Um, I don't know if you can see, but here the board is cooked. It's another color. Um, and the actual silicon from here is a little bit changed and here the board itself is popped so uh, yeah I popped these uh, chips but it just they they are just entered in short in short and um, after that they became super hot and just uh, heat up my transformer in cables um, thank you for watching and see you next time.